What happens to a Christian after a life of lawlessness? Yeshua said in John 14 verse 15, If you love me, keep the commandments, namely, my commandments. Here is the sequence of events that will happen to those Christians who disobey Yahweh's commandments during their lifetime. 1. You called on Yeshua and were saved. You were baptized and received the first fruits of the Holy Spirit. 2. You went through life faithfully attending a Sunday meeting church. You obeyed nine of the Ten Commandments, because that's what you had been taught. You exercised some gifts of the Spirit. But, upon your death your name is blotted out of the Lamb's Book of Eternal Life. Revelation 3 verse 5 He that overcomes, the same shall be clothed in white raiment, and I will not blot out his name out of the Book of Life, but I will confess his name before my Father, and before his angels. Why? Because you did not overcome sin, lawlessness. You habitually disobeyed Yahweh's law. 3. You appear before Yeshua at the judgment. You are rejected from reigning because you had been lawless, even though you still have the first fruits of the Holy Spirit. Matthew 7 verse 21 to 23. Not everyone who says to me, Master, Master, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven, but the one who is doing the will of my Father, who is in heaven. Many will say to me in that day, Master, Master, did we not prophesy through your name? And did we not cast out demons through your name? And did we not perform many miracles through your name? And then I will confess to them, I never knew you. Depart from me, you who work lawlessness. For, however, Yeshua will allow you into the millennial kingdom, but in a mortal body. Because of your lawlessness during this lifetime, you will be called least in the kingdom. You will learn to obey all of his commandments, while there, because you still have the first fruits of the Holy Spirit. 5. At the end of the millennial kingdom you will be awarded eternal life because you learned to obey all ten of the Ten Commandments. It is then you will receive the wholeness of the Holy Spirit and an eternal body. Revelation 20 verse 11 to 15 then I saw a great white throne and the one who was sitting on it, from whose face the earth and the heaven fled away, and no place was found for them. And I saw the dead, small and great, standing before Yahweh, and the books were opened, and another book was opened, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of the things written in the books, according to their works. And death and the grave were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. And if anyone was not found written in the book of life, he was cast into the lake of fire. Since you obeyed the Ten Commandments during the Millennial Kingdom, your name will be written in the book of eternal life. As you see, this is extremely serious. We are to fear Yahweh and obey His commandments. Now is the acceptable time to change your ways while you are still breathing. Today is the day of salvation.